Christmas is almost coming. So this morning um, I am heading off ice skating. It was supposed to be a big family event. Harry was supposed to be coming, David and Emily, but it's just us two at the minute and Emily's friend's gonna be coming. Um, obviously with David and his pneumonia, ice rinks don't really mix and I forgot Harry had a birthday party. Great plan in there. So it is just gonna be Emily and I and her friend. I'm not sure how much we're gonna be filming because this one's a little bit embarrassed by her mum's vlogging. So I'll do sort of a little bit of filming um, and see how we go. I'm also very tired. I've been awake since half past six yesterday morning and it's now half past eight because I've been on a night shift as well. Yep, all great planning. So I will catch you in a bit at the ice rink. Oh my god, this is literally the hardest thing I've ever done. I've only been around once. Uh, I'm actually doing it. I'm just doing some shopping in the Lowry. This place is empty. I don't know why I'm trying to even shop. We'll see if we can find anything, those last minute bits. Um, but yeah.
just got back from ice skating. I uh, had a really, really good time. It wasn't a bad um, deal either. We, I got a voucher code through Woucher. Um, so we spent £30, so it would have been £30 for the four of us. Whereas if you'd have gone on the day, it was um, at least £40 for, the, for a family of four. So it wasn't too bad. Obviously really missed David and Harry, um, but still had a fantastic time. I can't get warm now though. The Lowry Outlet is really bizarre. It's such a strange place. I don't know, I don't know how it stays open. It needs a new lease of life. It's got so much potential. Um, it just needs um, more shops. Some more, yeah, some more shops putting in. I've now been awake for how many hours? About 32 hours I've now been awake for. I don't think I'm looking too bad. Yeah, I don't think I'm looking too bad. I've got to get some jobs done again. Um, Emily's friend is now staying for a sleepover. Um, so yeah, I'll quickly tidy the house before she comes round. And yeah, more fudge to be made. We might even make some gingerbread men today and maybe watch a Christmas movie. I think it's about time we use those hot chocolates today. We haven't used those hot chocolate spoons that I made. So I think tonight's gonna be the night. Um, put my feet up. I might even have an afternoon nap. So that sounds like a plan to me. Um, yeah, so let's get on cracking around with some jobs and we'll catch you with you in a bit. It's that time again, it's fudge time. Oh my God, I've lost count the amount of times I have made this this week. So we've had one okay batch, one rubbish batch that I've actually hurt my wrist making because I've mixed it so much. One really good batch and now we're on to a fourth batch. I can't count. The fourth batch and the flavour's gonna be mince pies. Yeah, it's actually gonna be mince pies. Basically what you do is you bash up mince pies and put it in the fudge. That's it, that's simple. So bear with me, because this takes a long time to make. Well, it'd be rude not to have your own glass when you're making Irish cream fudge. Cheers, Merry Christmas. Got to test, Got to test the Irish cream for making Irish cream fudge. Cheers. So that is it. The last batch of fudge is made. A nice Irish cream one. I don't want to see fudge ever, ever again. Yeah. Girls, there will be no fudge next year. You heard it here first on this channel. No, not doing it again. Mr. A, you can quote me next time because I'm not doing it again. Watch this space. This time in 365 days, I'll probably be doing the same again. I'm exhausted. I've been awake for 36 hours. I have made two batches of fudge today. And that is it. Apart from a, one other batch of mince pies, I have done all my Christmas baking. So this probably won't be the baking channel anymore. The kids will, however, be doing a gingerbread house, but that is on a different vlog, probably when I'm asleep in bed, because I am on nights as of tomorrow, right up till Christmas morning. So yeah, the kids will be doing that on a separate vlog. So you might even be getting the UK Disney kids channel for a little bit, the kids take over. Yeah, exhausted now. The dinner is on. I want a large glass of wine and I want to sit down and put my feet up. I think that is what I'm going to be doing. So I might as well sign off this channel, sign off this vlog even, not sign off this channel, sign off this vlog for tonight. If we do make the hot chocolate spoons, I will add it at the end. I'm not sure yet. Um, it depends how I feel, because I'm exhausted now. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching guys. Um, hope you've enjoyed it. Um, have any of you guys been ice skating? Um, it was really, really good fun. So I do recommend it, even for the little ones. They do have little help, helping aids and stuff. I really enjoyed it. So next time, hopefully David and Harry can join us when David's no longer ill and Harry's not at a party, so yeah. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you're really enjoying this Vlogmas series. Um, it's something new to me, something I've never done before. Really enjoying it. It's really hard work though, especially when you're just going to work all the time and trying to think of things to do when you're at work and when you work long days like I do. So anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to click that like and subscribe button. 
Yay, did it, did it first time. Like and subscribe button. Don't forget to subscribe, guys. We would love it and love all those comments. I love reading those comments. And I do catch up with them eventually. It means the world to us. Anyway, thanks for watching. Take care. Hope you're all having a fabulous weekend. Bye.